Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. Excuse me. So we are going to see how you feel about your person or the person that you're coming to the reading for cancer and then we're going to pull the energy for um how your person feels about you we're going to get some advice and an outcome so let's get into it all right so let's see how does cancer feel about their person the person they're coming to the reading for the page of cups so you feel like um this could be a new person or you just feel like they're younger than you a little bit emotionally immature spoiled boastful is what i heard um pretty they could be in a beauty fashion industry uh of some sort um they could be well dressed met well maintained um they're trying to be romantic or there's a cause for them to be more romantic with you or they're trying to say that nice things or they're saying nice things to you they're surprised something about the element of surprise in how they're engaging with you. How do you, how does cancer feel about this person? The death card, like there's been some change, okay, or some transition, maybe of their personality, of who they are. It's like they're trying to let something die within them. Maybe um, they could also be trying to bring the relationship back. Maybe the relationship ended and they're trying to bring it back. Um, there also could be a shift in um, what they, what you know them to be, what they have been, what they've shown themselves to be in terms of their personality, in terms of, of who they really are, who they were. It's like they're trying to uproot themselves or uproot who you know they, they showed you they were. It's like they're trying to do something different. It's like they're, they're letting one aspect of themselves completely end or, or, or like they're shedding old skin. Maybe if they were always harsh in terms of their words with you or harsh in terms of just the relationship they're trying to be different they're trying to engage differently they also could be just trying to bring the relationship back from the dead let's see how this person feels about you cancer how does this person feel about cancer so they feel like um you're the working mom if you have children uh queen of pentacles um you do you work hard you're still out there making things happen. You have multiple streams of income. You're concerned about your health, well-being. Uh, you're concerned about your your life's luxuries. Interior, interior designer. Yeah, they feel like you're concerned about your career, okay? And you're concerned about your career moving forward. You're concerned about yourself. You're more focused on yourself than love. This is how they feel about you. It's like you're you're staying in control of your emotions and your um, your thoughts. You're not letting either get the best of you. There's no outburst. There's a a con control direction or control action. The Queen of Pentacles. Um, you feel like you're at a place of growth, prosperity, abundance, uh, fertility. They could feel like you're kind of self-centered or self-focused, self-directed right now. What's the advice for cancer? What is the advice for cancer? Ace of Pentacles. So um, something could have manifested for you. Like you were hoping that this was going to happen. And it could be anything. So now you're in a place of self-actualization. Like you're psychologically, in your mind, you understand that you can make things happen for yourself. You could have manifested a large sum of money, a new job, a new offer, maybe even this person coming back to you. Um, you could start a new physical uh, uh, exercise routine and maybe you're manifesting better health. But there's some manifestation that you, you had put out to the universe. You had started to you know, make or take action on. And now the, the tangible thing is here. It also says opportunity, opportune, opportune time, opportunity for you to grow, 
something grow this relationship what is the ace of pentacles here what is the ace of pentacles the magician so i knew it something about manifestation um but this is all like self-directed self-focused energy i don't know if it has anything to do with love and love relationships it's just more so more you maybe you manifested more money more opportunity for yourself more clientele more business uh, more streams of income um if cancer takes the advice of the cards say the right thing make sure you use your words right you're very skilled if you take the advice of the cards you get the okay the knight of wands and the queen of wands so something happens real fast for you the queen of wands talks about getting a lot done in a short amount of time you are coming up as two queens so it's like you're doing you're doing a lot right now a lot is going on and it could be surrounding your purpose in life your career um, money making it's going to be opportunity that presents itself to you you're going to have to act fast on it it says um life is going to go really fast for you it's going to uh, be a lot of fun a lot of uh spontaneous opportunity you're going to get a fair and just outcome here you're going to get what is karmically due unto you could be dealing with the libra you're going to get a lot of eyes on you you know um if you're in business for yourself it says that put yourself out there self-promotion is definitely highlighted here it's like your person is focused on love and being lovey and they may just be a little emotionally immature and becoming unraveled um, because they see you coming into knowing your worth knowing that you're a good catch focused on you focused on prosperity and money focused on your career your studies and you're getting you're making things happen for yourself you may even be moving or making some move what is the hidden element in this relationship for cancer realizations and epiphanies like maybe somebody's realizing your worth or you're realizing your worth or something was realized for you back to the ace of pentacles like something happened like you put it out there and it came back and it was real grief work okay if you are unsettled in your emotions speak to somebody about that go through the grieving process they say it's five stages to grief um, if something has happened, if you need to let someone go, if you need to grieve a relationship, go through it. Don't ignore it because it'll just resurface. This is what I have for you, Cancer. This is a really good reading, especially for those of you who are just focused on you and your business and your career. It looks like love will come all, you know, when, when, it's, when it's time, when you are ready for that. But right now, it's like you're focused on you, your life purpose and your direction and moving forward okay so this is what i have for you cancer go over to the website book your own reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below um you can also catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 8 30 p.m eastern standard tonight uh, you can come for the collective reading you can also ask a question thank you cancer many blessings to you take care